and I keep saying that every moment should be used as a learning moment. This is what she's going to be faced with in the world. This is what we're faced with in the world today. And I want to commend everyone on that page, on that live, that held themselves together. And I know it was hard for y'all to bite y'all tongue. It was hard for me to bite mine. So I try to combine it with humor and lesson. I know. That was difficult. Why, why, why not? Why, why, why not? Kick. Hey. Why, why, why not? to why 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 not it's your girl by laundry and i want to thank all of you for coming in today before we get started please like this video subscribe to my channel hit that bell so you have notification every time that i post please share 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 so my channel can continue to grow i'm almost at 600 y'all help me get over my thousand mark go over to tyra's channel tyra's big world of flavor Hey, this is Tyra's big flavor. And do this exact same for her. And happy, happy, happy morning. Y'all, just eating some leftovers. Wanted a sandwich. Had another pork chop leftover. So put that in the um, air fryer. Give me a pork chop sandwich with a little lettuce and tomato. I say, my grace, Lord, I want to thank you for this food that we're about to receive. Help it to nourish our bodies. In these words, we ask in your son Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Well, y'all, it's your pray lady. I'm wearing my praise. Getting ready to eat a sandwich. I just want to come and talk. And hopefully you will talk back. Yeah, I really have much to say today. Is this I want to come on and chat with you since I can't go live. When y'all get me to the point where I can go live, then we can do a whole bunch of chatting. But until then, I'm just gonna come on here with you all to chat and have a little sandwich. So, I, like I said, I have a little bit of mayonnaise. Um, lettuce, tomato, hot sauce, and my pork chop. Hmm. I need that. Guess this is no wrapping hands, mouth challenge. It'll be okay. But y'all. Yeah. Things aren't getting too much better. I don't know how many of you been watching the news and saw what just happened with the with the with the male, black male, with his kids in the back seat. And it's like like you might as well be scared to move. You try not to live in fear. But with what's going on in the world the least little thing you do, they act as if they're threatened. It's not fair for us. We can't move how everybody else moves. And that's the sad part. We can't move normally like everybody. We have to be super cautious. And even if we're super cautious and we're moving right, we're still intimidating others. And it's sad. We really need to stop this. 
There's no way in the world others should feel this intimidated by us black people just because we're standing there. We could be standing there with a smile on our face. And others act like they are so intimidated and threatened just from our presence. That's just like on Tyra's live last Thursday. And I could see where a lot of you all were coming from. I may have felt that he took a lot of time in the live. But actually, if you really look at it, we were responding to questions that were given to us by everyone. So it's not like we weren't answering the questions given to us by everyone. It's not like we really paid that person any attention. We did address some things, but I felt, and I know a lot of you wanted that person to be blocked or removed. But we all know how YouTube works. Have we blocked or removed the person? What a person like that would do. They will go out, make another account right quick, come back in, do the exact same thing. So because individuals do, does things like this, I want to use that as an example. And I know it wasn't my channel, and it was Tyra's channel, which is a child. But I feel, and I keep saying it, every moment should be used as a learning moment. This is what she's going to be faced with in the world. This is what we're faced with in the world today. And I want to commend everyone on that page, on that live, that held themselves together. And I know it was hard for y'all to bite y'all tongue. It was hard for me to bite mine. So I try to combine it with humor and lesson. I know. That was difficult. But with our youth, and how they are today. And they are so quick to react in a manner that makes them look bad. I wanted to show them or those that's watching how to handle situations like that. Where it don't look like where it doesn't look as if you are wrong. Or you're just being defensive. You respond in a manner that answers the person intelligently and doesn't demean who you are as a person. It's sad. It just shows us how individuals think of us because it even went that route on that on there that way by the person but I commend you all again for not stooping to that level because that's the trigger that they try and use always that trigger and a lot of us fall victim to it and become irate and the person that they draw us out to be I understand, mate, the person that they draw us out to be. And it's difficult to try and control that, especially when you got someone that's constantly pushing that button. But I just wanted to try and, you know, demonstrate a different way, a different approach to handle situations like that. The sad part is, 
had that been face to face, what would the outcome have been? Even though we were calm, even though we were responding professionally, would we still be at fault? I think they'll say we were. Why? Because of this. I think so. So it's like not much we can do that's right. Although what we're doing is right. But in their eyes, it's not right. It's going to be something wrong with what we're doing. I'm going to take this off. That's a little soggy. Y'all know I don't do soggy bread. So y'all, we got to keep praying. We have to keep praying that individuals will face facts and let us live. Let us be us. You know? We're not hurting nobody. We're not hurting anybody by cracking a joke. They crack jokes by smiling. They smile by walking up the street. They walk by jogging. By breaking up an altercation. Now normally, we are the main ones running from an altercation. But when we try to break it up so they're so that they're doing the right thing and not getting hurt by others, this will happen. It's sad. It's sad. It's like it's inevitable. It's like it's a blueprint. A game book. A step-by-step -step instructions. That we are omitted from receiving. So we. Have to figure out a different strategy. To pay closer attention to them. To beat them at their game. But again, I commend all of you for being strong, supportive, and true family to Tyra and I, especially to Tyra. Because I know had I not been there, y'all would have handled that. I know y'all would have handled that. So I truly love y'all for that. And y'all, we have to come up with our own game plan. Our own strategy. Our own playbook that we don't share. We quick to share our, our ideas. Mainly because a lot of us are not in a position to help. Because the majority of them are in position to do everything. Well, I'm sorry. My, my lips are sealed now. I'm only doing what I'm required to do. Not too much of a mess. So comment y'all feelings. On this issue. What could be our game plan? What direction should we be going in? Because like I said, a lot of the things we do, there's nothing wrong with what we do. But they're just so intimidated. Because of this. So we got to figure something out. That's what we have to do. In my opinion. Yeah, but y'all share with me what y'all think. I love to communicate with y'all about that down low. But. That's all I want to do is come on. And share a little something that was on my heart. On my mind. That I'm really seeking answers for. Because you can always think you have the answers. But it's good to have others. Especially those that can relate. What you're going through. Or can relate what you might be feeling. So y'all please remember to like this channel. Subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell. Skip notification every time that I post. Please share, share, share with everyone. So my channel can continue to grow. 
and also go to Tyra's Big World of Flavor and do the exact same with her channel. Join her channel, buy her um, books that's on Amazon as well as her merchandise that's on Teespring. And why, why, why not? Fan together so we can defeat what's going on. Love y'all.